Welcome back to Lumio's Tower. We're aiming to be the very best like no one ever was. And today, we're taking on another opponent. Here's the team. We have Crawdont with Aqua Jet, Knock Off, Crab Hammer, and Dragon Dance. Bramble Gas with Poltergeist, Rapid Spin, Power Whip, and Shadow Sneak. The Dunsparce with Roost, Coil, Body Slam, and Zen Headbutt. Galarian Slowbro with Psychic, Shell Sidearm, Slack Off, and Ice Beam. Noivern with Air Slash, Draco Meteor, U-Turn, and Boom Burst. And Lucario with Aura Sphere, Vacuum Wave, Steel Beam, and Psychic. Really excited for this battle. Before we get into it, a quick question of the day. And that is, what year do you think Gen 10 is going to be coming out? you think it'll be next year in 2025? Or do you think it'll be in 2026? Let me know in the comments below. Let's get into the match. Okay, so today we are battling the man, the myth, the legend, Evan. Who is bringing Meowskarada, Iron Treads, uh, Blaziken, Tornadus, Golden Go, and Intellion. So a pretty, pretty crazy team here. Um... We've battled a Tornadus once. Jordan was using it. Uh, so not Evan, but it was horrifying and I hated it. So I am horrified and I hate that. Huh. I don't know who I want to lead with. I honestly don't. I want to preserve uh, the, the Bramble Gas just in case the Iron Treads like sets up rocks. Or, you know, maybe something will surprise me and be a rock setter when I didn't know it was. So that's something to keep in mind. I'm kind of tempted to lead to Dunsparce, kind of, but I think we might just play it safe and lead Noivern, and we can U-turn out, depending on what comes out first, or we could try to predict what comes out first. I mean, we could. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. We're, we're just, we're just gonna, we're not gonna overthink this. We're just gonna lead Noivern. I think... When in doubt, I, like, when I'm not certain, because sometimes, like, for example, I had a battle a few weeks ago where someone had an Ariados on their team, and I was, like, pretty certain that they were going to lead Ariados on that team because uh, I thought they were going to set up Sticky Web. So I led Amon specifically, you know, to shut the Ariados, Ariados down. Um, but when you don't know, I think it really is good to just kind of lead a U-Turner and, you know, you can figure it out as you go. Okay. So, like, for example, here, I think we're actually going to be looking at a situation where he's actually uh, going to be uh, setting up Stealth Rocks. So I actually don't love that we have Noivern here. I think we're going to U-turn into... See, I'm a little scared about you turning into Lucario. Because... Uh, you know, if this thing outspeeds us and its speed has been raised, then that can be a little dangerous. I think we're going to... It's using knockoff. That's okay. And it is outspeeding Noivern. So no shot that it doesn't outspeed Lucario. Yeah, we're going to go into Crawdont here. Uh, he can go for another knockoff. This Crab Hammer is not going to tickle even if he switches. I'm tempted to tear a Crab Hammer. Huh. Yeah, you know what? Why not? Let's tear a Crab Hammer. I don't usually like to tear this early in the game. That tends to make me nervous. But Crawdont likes his team. And because of that, the only thing that could be a little nerve-wracking is if we see a switch into... Or not a switch, but uh, if we see a switch into Blaziken, that'd be great. But if you know, something happens, uh, he has to bring in a Mon after I've used a move, so you like a Pokemon faints, and he brings in Blaziken, he can always protect, then and he'll outspeed even without the protect, and he can go for a uh, close combat, and that would, that would suck. Kind of wish we had gone for Crab Hammer, or Dragon Dance there then, but it's okay. Mm. 
Okay. Probably gonna see a flower trick here. So we could go into Slowbro. Hmm. Yeah, we'll go into Slowbro. The Meowskarata is something I'm a little afraid of. Um, I said just the Blaziken. I don't know why I blanked on the Meowskarata, but I am very afraid of the Meowskarata. You turn. Okay. Did a lot too. Probably gonna go into Golden Go here. Yeah, Gabagool. This just kind of is a sucky position to be in. Um, we're going to go for Psychics. Maybe get some special defense drops. I don't mind too much Slowbro falling. That's not the end of the world. I never get the quick draw, quick claw. I have never in my life gotten the quick draw, quick claw. I'm really, I'm not exaggerating when I say I've never gotten the quick draw, quick claw. <laughs> He's in a pretty position now. He's actually in a very pretty position. I think... I think we're gonna go to Dunsparce, honestly. Coil up, start sending out some Zen headbutts. Hopefully we can get the Dunsparce to kind of scare him out. Like, you know, maybe he'll think that I've got, you know, a ground move or something on me. So we're just gonna go for a coil this turn. Okay, and he is switching. fine hopefully he does not go back out into the golden go please don't be the golden go because i went for body slam no okay good get get the para get the para come on get the para yes okay that's really nice and now we're just gonna go for another zen headbutt Okay. I think I want to go for another coil here. I do. Oh, it's Focus Blast. Okay, well, that's... That's still... That actually did not do that much. Like, that was actually... I'm relatively impressed with Dun the Dunsparce taking that. Um, Focus Blast miss could happen. So, or we could predict the Focus Blast and go into Bramblegast. I 
I think we're going to play to the Focus Blast Mist. Hope, hope that it happens and go for a Roost. It doesn't happen. That's okay. Okay. We should outspeed, and we're going to go for Poltergeist here. I do kind of wish we had just switched into Bramble Gas, but, you know. A dark move is the obvious play, so I think we go Lucario. Okay, we're seeing a Terra. Terra Dark. Probably going to switch into Gimme or Gimme Ghoul Golden Go here. Probably. Um, just in case, though, I feel like we have to go for a Vacuum Wave. Uh, it could also be a U turn situation. So we could go for Vacuum Wave, hoping we go first and maybe take it out. I don't know if we're in range to take it out, but so close. So close. In fact, close enough now where honestly I feel comfortable going Bramble Gas and Shadow Sneaking it. He said uh, she lived on 4 HP. And now we are going to go for a poltergeist here, obviously. Oh, Wind Rider, so cool. Oh man, I've never used Bramble Gas before, so this is like really nice for me. I'm liking this. Okay, this is this is actually a really cool mon. I really like Bramble Gasp now. Nice. 
Nice. Okay, I think that's all the mons. Uh, thank you so much, Evan, for accepting the challenge. Guys, be sure to show some love to my opponent in the comments below, as well as answer the question of the day. All that fun stuff. Like, subscribe, hit the bell, and until next time, keep on climbing to the top.